हे माई चैंपियंस दिस इज अभिनव नेगी एंड आई वेलकम यू ऑल गाइस एयरपोर्ट अथॉरिटी ऑफ इंडिया हैज डिसाइडेड दैट विल बी टेकिंग केयर ऑफ ऑल इंजीनियर्स ऑफ देयर जॉब्स इट इज लुकिंग लाइक सो फ्रॉम लास्ट टू थ्री डेज फर्स्ट एयरपोर्ट अथॉरिटी ऑफ इंडिया हैज कम अप फॉर द इंजीनियर्स विद गेट फाइव नाइनटी सिक्स वैकेंसीज एंड दिस टाइम एयरपोर्ट अथॉरिटी ऑफ इंडिया हैज कम अगेन फॉर एवरी इंजीनियर इवन फॉर द फाइनल ईयर स्टूडेंट्स ऑल्सो फॉर एवरी ब्रांच विद 356 vacancies in ATC department. Yes, there are some other vacancies टू फोर टू बट दैट आर फॉर ह्यूमैनिटीज बैकग्राउंड आई एम टॉकिंग ऑफ इंजीनियर्स दैट इज थ्री फिफ्टी सिक्स वैकेंसीज ऑफ जूनियर एग्जीक्यूटिव सेम वैकेंसी सेम पोस्ट एज दैट ऑफ गेट एग्जामिनेशन ओके एंड देर नंबर ऑफ वैकेंसीज आर थ्री फिफ्टी सिक्स बट दिस टाइम ए टी सी हैज कम अप विद थ्री फिफ्टी सिक्स वैकेंसीज एंड दीज वैकेंसीज लेट मी टेल यू अगेन आर नॉट through gate they will be taking their own exam what is that own exam what is that pattern everything i'll be telling you what are the cutoffs in the last many years everything i'll be telling you you might be thinking who is besides me he is mr vaibhav he has done his mtech from iit delhi and he is currently am of airport authority of india and he has also given the gate examination and he has gone to airport authority through gate Okay, so let me just tell you about this notification. Then we'll be coming to Mr. Vaibhav about the work-life balance there, the life there, and what is ATC all about? What is the work culture? What is the difference between the gate seats that are going to Airport Authority of India and the students who are going here in ATC that are without gate? What is the difference in their work profile, job, salary? Everything we'll be discussing with Mr. Vaibhav. First of all, just let me tell you quickly about this notification. okay so guys uh, atc that the number of vacancies are 356 and the eligibility is that either you are a bsc student or a btech student but your physics and mathematics will be as one of the subjects in your semester okay i guess that most of you in the first year are having physics and mathematics so you might all are eligible for this now talking about the um, number of marks it should be that 60% you should be scoring in your btech okay age should be 27 years for atc Okay, sixty percent. You should be scoring in your B Tech. Now coming about the dates, the form will be available from twenty second of December up to twenty first of January. You can fill the form. There will be online examination, but the date of online examination has not been disclosed yet. Nothing to do with gate. Okay, and the post is equivalent to that of gate. Okay, now the students who are in final year, they are also eligible. the condition is that only after giving the exam when the document verification will be there you should be submitting your degree otherwise you are eligible now coming about the vacancies and the details everything let me just tell you that examination will be of 120 marks in 120 minutes that is 2 hours and total number of questions are also 120 120 questions 120 minutes and 120 marks Out of those one twenty questions or one twenty marks, sixty questions or sixty marks will be non tech, English, reasoning, aptitude, general knowledge, and sixty marks will be physics and math, eleventh, twelfth class physics and math. So know your engineering discipline. You are from civil, mechanical, electrical, electronics. Those questions will not be asked. Either sixty marks non technical, maths, aptitude, English, or sixty marks uh, plus six or any, and sixty marks physics and mathematics. now if i talk about the things or syllabus in english these are the things i'll give you the detailed pdf of all these syllabus in my telegram group civil by abhinav sir these are the things for intelligence part okay then aptitude ratio proportion average time work permutation combination that is generally in aptitude and then in general knowledge the basic thing geography books general science indian economy modern history important dates everything i'll be giving you in my telegram okay all these things now these are for 60 marks now again 60 marks for physics and maths So physics will be laws of motion, thermal properties of matter, thermodynamics, uh, rotational motion, gravitation, motion in static line, motion in plane. These are all the parts of twelfth class and eleventh class physics, including laws of motion and electric field and everything. Maths also the same thing. Eleventh and twelfth class maths will be there. Okay, so sixty marks will be non-tech and sixty marks will be physics and maths combined. Then after the online examination, nothing to do with gate. I am again telling you there is a voice test because ATC you are controlling the traffic now, so your voice should be clear. so after clearing the exam there is a voice test also now let me tell you after 120 marks there is no negative marking no negative mark the cut off in the various years are 6400 271 87 95 and please don't get demoralized with these high cut offs from 120 because there is no negative mark this is equivalent to 
you can say this 95 is almost equivalent to 80 85 marks or even lesser if there is negative marking because see it is very simple na there are 120 questions suppose 80 questions you know then for 40 questions you are attempting na because there is no negative marking so out of those 40 questions 10 will be correct on the base of probability so that marks are also added here see the science behind it see the logic behind it now about the strategy we'll be taking uh, taking a session detail on it but let me ask Mr. Weber, first of all, Weber, very welcome here. Thank you for having me, sir, here. Okay. So, the students want to know that just two days back, uh, the Airport Authority of India has come up with seats for the GATE students from 2020, 21, 22. And you are also joined Airport Authority through GATE. So, what is the difference between that seat and this ATC? Sir, basically, there is no difference uh, among those two seats. Just the mode of examination. That is from GATE and this is from online. And there is no difference in salary package and nothing else. Uh, only difference is both uh, those seats are for civil and electrical and uh, communication and this is for ATC and ATC generally goes for online examination and then voice test after that. Oh, so in ATC nothing gate or nothing is required? No, no, no. no. And the post in uh, that is also junior executive? The same, same, same E11 post. Okay. E, sorry, E1. Even. So, when you join through GATE, that is also even, junior even, executive. Even post. And the IOCL mis select hai, from GATE, unka aur ye equivalent hai? Okay, or ATC when they, the students will be joining in ATC, so what is the work culture there? In ATC, uh, you will be getting, I think, half an hour rest after every two hours of channeling. Channeling means you will be navigating, then you will be getting half an hour rest, and you will extra uh, you will be getting extra benefits also, like there are ratings and stress allowance. And for ratings, you have to qualify certain tests after you will be eligible for rating in the next quarter. Okay. So, you mean to say that salary is same as that of gate student, but salary here stress same. stress allowance is more. The stress allowances are more. Okay. And, uh, and mainly for civil electrical, you might get uh, posting in some Z class cities, but in ATC, you mostly you will be getting in X and Y class cities. Okay, X and Y class so means? you have, uh, uh, you mean HRA is more. Okay. You okay. can say that in X class it is, it is 24% and in Y class it is 16. And in AI through gate you can post it anywhere? Anywhere, anywhere in India. Okay, okay. X, Y and other is that? X, Y, Z. Okay. So guys, this is all about ATC. Let me again tell you <coughs> that no gate is required. All branches are eligible. Finally, the students are also eligible. Just you have to give a test of 120 marks, 60 of non-technical and 60 of physics and maths and this is the cutoff. It is easily achievable by guys because it is no negative marking here. Okay, so go and get it. Thank you. Take care. Please let me know in the comment box if you are having any other doubts. Thank you.